Welcome back and happy Wednesday. We have a look at your temperatures as we head into about the six o'clock hour. So warming up a little bit more across those interiors out of the 30s and into the 40s. And then you can see those coastal valleys already right around the 50s. And in some cases outside right now, some of those coastal valley regions right around the upper 50s. So we're already pretty warm at this hour and we have another day with temperatures that will be above average as we head into the peak hours of the afternoon. And here's a look at that microclimate forecast. Mostly clear skies for your morning commute. Not much changes as we head into your afternoon, even later tonight, especially as those winds really start to ramp up across the central coast. And breaking down the details with that, we have high and low pressure systems that are actually going to aid in some wind development, primarily for our south coast regions in Santa Barbara County. So if we take a closer look at the wind forecast, a bit breezy heading into your afternoon. Those wind speeds from 15 to 25 miles per hour for the most part. That really does include most of San Luis Obispo County. The coastal regions, also parts of northern Santa Barbara County, changes a little bit though as we get towards our south coast region. We're actually expecting some sundowner winds later tonight. They could linger into early tomorrow morning, but we can really see that wind activity picking up across Santa Barbara County's mountains and foothills, especially with that yellow coloring, indicating some of those wind speeds close to about 35 miles per hour, which could then prompt a wind advisory. We are anticipating that for later this afternoon into this evening for details on that when it is issued, of course, We'll have that for you at KSBY.com. Now talking about some other details with the forecast on this Wednesday. High surf advisory in place until about 8 o'clock tonight. And that goes for San Luis Obispo County area beaches and northern Santa Barbara County. And you can see here those breaking waves will range from 8 to 12 feet. We have those dangerous rip currents. Highest surf will be on the west and northwest facing beaches. That does include most of San Luis Obispo County area beaches. And taking a look at the wave heights right now, 6 to 8 feet, of course, we can increase as we head into this morning and your afternoon because we're expecting to reach about 12 feet with those wave heights. Over the next three days, not much changes. I would say by Saturday, that's when we start to taper off and start to return to those seasonal averages. We're out of the 70s for the most part, back to the mid to upper 60s, but still some great weather in store. We'll have plenty of sunshine by then as well. For today, 72 degrees in Paso Robles. We have 73 for San Luis Obispo. Upper 60s for areas like Santa Maria as well as Lompoc if you're in the Santana's Valley. Still right around the low to mid 70s today. Cooler for those deeper inland valleys for Cuyama, California Valley, Shandon, all back to those 60s again. Low 70s for your five cities region, and we still have that mix of 60s and 70s along the North Coast. I'll send it back to you. All right, thank you, Brooke. The time is 542. Coming up next on Day.